Hello, everyone. Dave here. Hey, I just wanted to give a quick video on one of these uh, Chinese ATC PH PH slash zero zero nine I pen type pH meters. Okay, um, bought one of these. You know, I was trying to step it up from my, you know, my papers and uh, trying to brew some beer, and I got this thing and. First, I wanted to calibrate it. it. Came with these nice little packets. 250 milliliters of distilled water at 25 degrees. You dump this stuff in, and this should give you a pH of four. And then you take this packet here, dump it in, should be a pH of six. So, distilled water, dump the packets in, got the temperature correct. And uh, I got these things perfect. So I was like, oh, yeah, that's cool. So uh, it does say to, in between tests, to dump it or wash it in distilled water. So did that, and um, but then I thought, well, you know, distilled water has a pH of 7. So when I stuck the meter in, it would not read 7. And uh, it's driving me kind of nuts. So I'll give a little test here, and I'll show you what's going on. So first of all, we got a pH of, now nah, it's a little off, but you know, 4, 4 L. It's reading there, we go 4 L. So then what it says is take your distilled water, give it a little shake, and then just put it in this, and this should read a 6.8. We'll turn it on, we go 6.8, right on the money. So wash her off. Now this should, this is distilled water. Bought it from the store, steam distilled water. And my thought was this should read seven. And as you can see, we got 5.4. So this is what drove me nuts. So I was going back and forth thinking that maybe these were off and trying to, I, I would adjust this up to seven and then stick it back in here and then these were wrong. And I spent quite some time trying to figure this out. I just assumed this was junk uh, but upon some research, I uh, found this article from Vernier. Why doesn't my pH sensor read 7 in distilled or deionized water? pH electrodes will not give accurate pH values in distilled or deionized water. Blah, blah, blah. The ions, whatever. We don't need to read the whole thing. So, what I'm uh, getting at here is... Don't try to use distilled water to calibrate your meter because it doesn't work. Uh, you can rinse it off with it. The other thing after reading some of these articles about professional level pH meters is all of them say never to let the sensor, that little ball down there, dry out. And they make special solutions that you're supposed to keep them in. The, the better ones have little caps that are waterproof. Um, and they say if you don't have the special solution, you can use a pH of 4. So uh, what I'm going to start doing is just maybe taking the cap here and click, click it up. And maybe storing it in a little jar or something. Uh, but that's my two cents on these. Once I figured out that distilled water is not the way to go <laughs> or to calibrate with, uh, the thing seems fairly accurate. So... Uh, that's my uh, that's my video. Thanks for watching.